In this video, I'm going to go over some example ACT problems that involve expected value. So this one reads, at a local carnival, Jane will play a game where three die are rolled at the same time. Five points will be awarded for each six that is rolled face up. Let the random variable x represent the total number of points awarded on any roll of the three die. What is the expected value of x? So the expected value formula is the summation of p of x times x. So p of x is the probability of that happening and x is the value of that event. So here if you roll a 6 you get 5 points. If you roll anything else you get 0. So a probability of getting a 6 now there's 6 sides to a dice 1 through 6 so a 6 would be 1 out of 6 and the value that you get for it is 5 points. Now the probability of not getting a 6 is 5 out of 6. There's 5 numbers there that are not a 6 and you get 0 points for that. And then you're going to add them. Summation means to add them so we're going to add them together. So that's on the first dice. On the second dice is going to be the same thing. You got 1 out of 6 chance of getting a 6 and you get 5 points for getting that. And then you get 5 out of 6 chance of getting something other than a 6 and you get zero points for that. So the same thing repeated for the third one. All right, so if we figure that out, that's gonna be five over six. One over six times five is five over six, then plus zero. So again, five over six. 5 over 6. It's going to add up to 15 over 6. They don't have a common denominator of 6, so just add the numerators. 5 plus 5 plus 5 is 15. And if you break that as a mixed number, that's going to be 2, give you 12, and 3 left over. 3, 6, or two and a half. So our answer, our expected value for x would be two and a half points. So this one reads, at a local carnival, Jane will play a game where there are six cups to choose from. There is one cup with a one written inside of it, two cups with a two written inside, and three cups with a three written inside. She will be rewarded the number of points the cup has written inside it. Let x be the random variable of the number of points Jane will receive after selecting one cup. What is the expected value of x? So again, our equation is summation of p of x times x. All right, so we have one cup out of the six. There's one out of six chance of getting that cup, and you get one point. Now the two cups with the two written inside, you got two out of six chance of getting one of those cups. And you'll get two points for it. And the three cups with the three written inside, you have a three out of six chance of getting those, getting one of those. And you get three points for that. All right, so we multiply each out, you got one over six plus 4 over 6 plus 9 over 6. So 1 plus 4 plus 9 gives you 14. So 14 over 6, which will give you 2 and 2 6 or 2 and 1 third. So 2 and 1 third would be the expected value of this game. So I hope this video helped you understand how to find expected value.